so uh, I finally got out to the range with the new setup. I got my uh, new rings and rail in. Got the LaRue uh, 20 MOA with the LaRue Ultra Low um, quick detach rings. Um, took it out to the range um, Thursday and it was like six degrees out. I got out there first thing, got set up at sun up and started shooting. So. Um, it was really nice. I was very impressed with this scope, the Viper uh, PST. Um, went from the hot car because it took an hour to get out there, so the car got nice and warm and uh, got out there into six degree temperatures, no fog, nothing, crystal clear. Um, got sighted in. Um, this gun, being the one in ten twist, the AAC uh, 700, it really eats up the um, 168 grains. I, I got uh, some really good groupings with that. Once it's all said and done, all sighted in, um, I was using these bullets here. They're uh, Silver State Armory, 168 grain. Um, they can call them their match grade precision ammo. Um, it's a boat tail hollow point. Um, so, anyways, uh, those uh, the gun really liked. Here's some of the groups that I was able to get. Um, this first one here, you could see. Um, there's three that are touching all right on top of each other, and then there's two flyers. I felt those when I actually uh, was firing. I was on a metal bench, and the metal was very cold, and then the rubber um, stoppers of my uh, bipod slipped And um, as I was trying to load into the bipod. Um, and then I backed out of pushing into the bipod too hard because of that, and uh, was able to get those three, and then... Um, got this other group of three touching and uh, yeah so it uh, it's a complete system it works great let me show you the quick detach on these uh, rings they uh, return to zero that's what everybody says uh, I do have them marked with some LaRue rail covers to let me know that those aren't going anywhere so uh, let me flip this around and we'll get you another video okay so we got this flipped around these are the quick detach Roll them forward, they undo. Roll them forward, they undo. Scope comes right off. Um, as you see, I've got the rail clips marking where the scope needs to go. Lay it back down, push it forward, and then crank them back down, and it should return to zero. Uh, and that's why you pay uh, pay for the high quality uh, rings. And so, there it is. Uh, this whole setup I'm very pleased with. Um, I'm going to hopefully get out and start doing a lot more uh, um, shooting videos using this uh, weapon system. So anyways, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoy.